being forced to work from home and um, being someone who spent a lot of time um, away from home and, and trying hard to always make time for family, all of a sudden uh, uh, it just was at a stage of life that uh, it started looking a lot more appealing to uh, be around uh, our young kids. That was one of the factors in thinking about that and, and what, what led me to start contemplating that. I thought it was really very striking when I uh, was recovering from my surgery and uh, had not been around for a while and had not been um, to practices until I was feeling better. They'd been working out and doing doing some things uh, before I showed up and I was so impressed with how the team looked under her leadership. And so um, I, I would not have needed to see that to be confident in her because I've just worked so closely with her and know her so well and know how uh, high quality of a, a person she is. It was exciting to see how the team was responding to her and the coaching staff, and so that gave me a tremendous amount of confidence that the program was in very good hands, and that was always the goal. No matter how long you're there, uh, it's a temporary position, and you want to try to leave it better uh, than you found it, and um, I certainly know uh, my predecessor, Mickey DeMoss, did that for me, and I wanted to um, leave the program in, in really good shape, and, and so Kyra could uh, build her own uh, legacy and Kentucky women's basketball could continue to be successful. I'm going to write a book and, and try to talk about the things we did to help Kentucky women's basketball be successful and that was building uh, a championship team uh, each and every year was, was always the goal and uh, that certainly included the players but also the staff and bringing everyone together and, and so I think we learned so many lessons along the way that can be helpful. Out of the book, what I'm hoping to accomplish is um, not only to produce something that's helpful to others, but I think it'll be tremendously helpful for me as I try to contemplate um, finding a different way than coaching basketball to really make a contribution in the world, and that's something I still have a strong desire to do. So I didn't retire from uh, helping people or life, just retired from coaching college basketball. So I think the book uh, is going to be a very, um, I know it's a fun experience for me and an, and an eye-opening experience, and I'm learning a lot from the process, and hopefully it'll be something that benefits others as well.